I love the reaction of like, you just put boiling hot water in a bunch of sugar and some little bit of chocolate and nutmeg and you're like, hold on, let me see my reaction. Good morning. <sighs> Happy weekend. We did it. We made it. We survived another grueling week of retirement, but <laughs> got some rain, man. We got pure rain yesterday, rain last night, rain again this morning, although it's supposed to go away. I don't know. It's, the sun is supposed to come out. Let's look at it a little bit more optimistically. Yes, the sun's supposed to be arriving. I see it's on its way, hopefully, in the near future. I'm going to get back in the garden and I think we're going to pick some tomatoes today because according to the Google, <clears throat> uh, you don't have to wait for them to be fully red on the plant before you can pick them and we're kind of tired of them getting rotten or eaten. And so if Andre swings by, we're going to head out to the garden later today and pick some tomatoes for the first time. So looking forward to that. But before we do that, Here's to starting new things and trying out uh, new adventures. One sec. Put that one down. I'll be back. Don't worry. It's not goodbye. It's just goodbye for now. Yeah, yesterday Sonia made some amazing sorrel drink as she does. But rather than throw away all the sorrel after it's been boiled out and steeped, stooped, steeped, steeped it in. Mm. Um, looked up a recipe for actually uh, pickling or candying um, the sorrel. So behold, this is uh, the m monstrosity that is the sorrel. Um, and you'll notice there's a nice scotch bonnet pepper in there as well. But yeah, I was like, wait, why are we throwing all away all this sorrel? It tastes fantastic. Well, it's kind of bitter, but what could we do? So yay, internet. Uh, we have added the sorrel to the jar with um, equal parts water and vinegar and a quarter cup of sugar, a tablespoon of salt. I think that's it, to tell you the truth. And then I said to let it sit out for two to three weeks for it to just manifest into what it wants to become. So, I don't know, curious if you guys have ever pickled or candied sorrel before and what success or results that came of it for you. So stay tuned for a couple weeks from now. We'll be bringing this guy back out and trying to play, make sure he gets all the, yeah, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Airtight lids, knew this jar was going to be good for something. But so that's what the theme of today is, trying new things, even if they don't work out the best so, the kids are going to come by later today, cook something. Not sure what yet, but uh, the skies are coming out. It's going to be a good day. We're going to get something done productively on a Saturday. Why not, right? Why not? We're up early anyway. <sighs> I'm going to enjoy my coffee. Grab yours, grab your tea, sweeten it, or don't. Let's do this. Hello? Hello? Good morning. What's up? All right, good talk. What are the vowels, Andre? And sometimes? Why? Why? Because I said so. Bad joke of the day. Bah. <laughs> anyway, we're headed out to the garden. What are we going to go look for in the garden today? Tomato! 
I think he was trying to say tomatoes. Yeah, we're gonna go try and find a couple tomatoes that are starting tomatoes. to ripe. We also gotta measure the cauliflower. Eh? Remember, we gotta measure the cauliflower to see if it's big enough to take. Okay, come on. Yeah. You know what okay, else we're gonna do? You know what else we're gonna do? Okay, Papa. You know what else we're gonna do? I'm gonna pick up some rocks and start making a trail. Here we go. Huh? Okay. Andre, you know what they say, right? What do they say? I don't know. Oh, they say that the early bird gets the worm. You know what that means? No. You never heard the early bird gets the worm? No. Why are we here? Because we got the mega the color flower. Uh huh. And? Uh, we got to pick up some wraps we made out of something. Uh huh. And? And uh, we got uh, what is called? Tomatoes. Tomatoes. Okay, but first, here, let me see that. Let me get that. Okay, sir. Thank you. We're going to take a quick tour what of the. A quick tour of the Muddy Farm. Are you ready? I know. Let's go. Watch the mud. Woo! guys are little I don't even think we need to measure those but if we look at the measurements we're gonna lay it across the top you see how it starts at zero yeah. okay and then it goes all the way here's zero one two oh that's only three that's only three let's try the bigger ones over here yeah. let's try that one whoo that one's pretty close yeah, we need a What? Based on what measurement, sir? Hold on. Hold on. Okay, that is six inches. We need a picky. We could possibly pick that one today. Well, I'm not picking it yet, though. Hold on. Let's check this one. Let's measure up this one. Um, is that all the way? Uh. No. Oh, but this one's starting to flower already. That's not good. We might have to pick that one, too. All right, I think... Yeah, I think it's about that time to get these two before they flower anymore. Oh, you're still going. What do you see? No, that's only about three. Is it all the way? No, you know it's not all the way. All right. Well, guess what, sir? I think we're going to pick these two today. Except. Yeah, but we didn't bring any any scissors or nothing. We're going to have to go back and get a pair of scissors. Yeah, we're going to need a scissors. One more time. Put that in a bowl. Um. Nice. 
Three, All right, let me get a picture. Hold on, a smile on three. You gotta look here. That's not a smile. All right, that works. Cool, all right, we gotta bring that to the house. All right, Andre, we gotta do some math today. You ready? Are you ready? Yeah. How many peppers do we get? Three. How many tomatoes do we get? Three. How many cauliflowers do we get? Two. So, your math question of the day, are you ready? Yeah. How many total things do we take out of the garden today? Um, something to... Something to... Hold on. Three tomatoes, three peppers, and two cauliflowers. How many total things do we take out of the garden today? Three. Three tomatoes and three peppers. How much uh. is that? Four. Put three fingers on one hand and three on the other. That's your three tomatoes and that's your three peppers. How many total is it? Three. Count them together. Six. Six. Now put up two more fingers for the two cauliflower that we had. No, put your six fingers up that you had. Alright, let's try again. Okay, six fingers are up because you had six, three tomatoes, three peppers. Now put up two more fingers for the two cauliflower. Did you put up two more fingers? I see one. Put one more up. Now how many total things do we take out of the garden? Count your fingers. Yeah. So, can you tell me in a sentence? We took... We, we took... What? How many? Three peppers. Uh-huh. Three tomatoes. Uh-huh. Two four. Four. How many total? What? How many total did we take then? Two. Two cauliflower, three peppers, three tomatoes. How much, how much total was that? How many total fingers did you just count? Uh, uh, seven. <laughs> we'll keep working on it. Eight, Andre. Eight. Eight. Three and three and two. Three and three and two. Yeah, how much does that make? Eight. Okay, let's find some rocks. All right, Andre, you're gonna go show them the trail we made? All right, go to the, where's the trail at? Okay, me and Tyler were there picking rocks and I found a big rock. Uh huh. What do we do with them? Whoa! You want to show them the trail? Come around. Show them where we made. Yeah. All right. Let's walk it. Let's walk it. I'm walking. Following you. Now we have a trail. Oh, cool. <laughs> Buried treasure on the trail. Oh yes. So. It's a start. Andre, looks nice. You did a good job? Yeah. Ready to go clean up? Yeah. Alright, let's go. <laughs> you ready? All right, let's do it. Tell Google we need to set it for 10 minutes. Okay, Google, set the timer for 10 minutes. Okay, 10 minutes. Starting now. Starting now. He said, okay, 10 minutes. Or 
what they say, okay? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna boil these for 10 minutes. I don't know, we're gonna see. Okay, a little nervous about this one, but here we go. Oh, oh, hold on. Wait, it almost looks like mashed potatoes. You had mashed potatoes before? Ooh, smell that. What do you smell? <laughs> it smells like garlic. Wow, well I guess more for us, huh? Let's plate this and see how it tastes. You're nervous, why? Because. All right, you want the first bite? Okay. Okay. I'm so nervous. You can do it, Andre. Okay, Donna. Go for it. Just try it. Just try it. No? What's it taste like? What does it taste like? You gotta describe the taste for the people. Garlic and mashed potatoes? Uh -huh. I <laughs> you don't like it. Okay, well, uh, you try. Let's see what Sonia says. Okay, 0 for 1 on the judges so far. Let's try this one. <clears throat> A clove. One clove? Yes. And a one clove of garlic, this. Honey, one of garlic? With some butter, yes, I roasted it. One of the garlic? No, a clove. One. Sonia, try the potato, or the, the cauliflower. Tastes like garlic. Mm hmm. Well, it's supposed to be garlic mashed Where cauliflower. More butter in there. Yes, there's butter in there. Well, you need more butter. <sighs> Critics, man. <clears throat> I tell you, you can't win. Hold on, let me see. It's not pretty. I never said that it's good. You just said what it's missing. Butter. No, I'm sorry. Maybe. Hmm. I think it's fantastic. Mom would be proud. Try it out sometime. Garlic mashed cauliflower. Now you know. Well, you're supposed to wait till the cauliflower is cold before you put it in a pot. You want cold potatoes? Or cold it's cauliflower? Cold anyway. mm -hmm. Now back to your regular... Honey, was it supposed to be cold? Yes, you wanted hot. It's like it's supposed to be like mashed potatoes, except it's cauliflower. But mashed potatoes not hot when I eat it most of the time. Yes, it should. Well, when I eat mashed potatoes, they're hot. When I eat mashed potato, most of the time they're cold. Okay, so just put that down for half hour. Come back, and it'll be perfect. No, I'm gonna get some butter. <sighs> mashed cauliflower. I'm gonna enjoy mine. Thanks. All right, I'm going on record that I think this is pretty fantastic. Mom would be proud. Mashed cauliflower. No, nope. he wants it raw. All right, eat it with your more butter. Give us an opinion. But if you if you just cut oh, it boy. around, just put it with with me with me, you're good. Ew. That's all you do. That's all you guys eat. You want in the U.S. anyway? Now come in a Jamaican. No man, we eat it with ranch, not mayo. Ranch oil, yes. Oh. Yeah, ranch and mayonnaise are two different things, dear. <coughs> this is garlic. Garlic. Garlic's good for you. <laughs> you know what? I think it's fantastic. So try it out, even if others disapprove.
Okay, you know what time it is. It's time to work out. I brought some backup today. Hold on. Yeah, see those? Let's see the muscles, guys. Show them all those hard-working muscles that you... Yeah, we got some work to do. Nice. Anyway, I'm also going to introduce you guys to a new friend of mine. I know a couple weeks ago we introduced your 20 friend. Well, today, all things working out, we're going to be introducing the 25s. So, stay tuned for that. You guys ready to work out? Yes. All right, let's go. All right, Andre, we did it. You ready? Yeah. Where are we going? I what are we doing? We go to shopping. For what? For things. Oh, cool. Let's do it. I feel like I'm being followed with the Sonia Pace here today, and she's not even with us today. They're just so excited about walking up and down in town. Andre, let's go, on, man. We're never gonna get out of here. Good morning, sir. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Seriously guys, this is why we don't go shopping with the boys. Yeah boy. How much are fries? Other side dude, right behind you. Sure. Yes, that is a BMW, but we are 0 for 1 on the fries. Strike one, off to the next one. Where are we going? What? Calm down, Dave. All right, driver. To the fries, to the fries. Oh, yay. Oh. Thank you. 
Yeah, let's get two of those. Can you get it? One. All right, good job. I don't have, yes, let's look in the pantry and see what we can give. I don't know where Mario's going. All right, find us a taxi. <laughs> go on, Jay, go. We made it back in one piece. We're gonna give them some time on the iPad, but some of us are being more responsible than others and doing their work first. That's what I told you. That's what we agreed to. You're doing your writing now and you'll read later. Thank you for being responsible. Here we go. Dave's writing a half page entry, journal entry. So far we got this morning, I woke up. Let's see what happens. Andre, what time is it? What time is it? Yeah, but what are we doing right now? What? We're doing what? What? What Andre's trying to say is it's afternoon tea time. You might have seen that picture we put in at the grocery store. Yeah, the Lasko lady, she caught us. And she was like, you guys need tea. And we're like, we do. And we did. And now we have tea. Show them the tea. Oh, boy. All right, what do we need? Yeah. What do we need? Cold or hot? Hot. All right, here we go. Okay, push the button. This. Nope. This. Nope. Nope. Is it? It's on the side. This. Yep. Push it up or down, I don't remember. Maybe up. Woohoo! All right, hot water, here we come. It's when it goes off, it's ready. Why is it going off yet? Oh, true story. Andre, what we just realized? We got the same tea! <laughs> we got the same tea, yeah, I didn't even notice. I got coconut and nutmeg. <gasps> you got coconut and nutmeg. What does that mean? <laughs> Yay! We're twins. I'm here. Oh, it's I'm him. here. It's the It's me. Party Grand killer. Mafia. Oh, hey, Pri. Huh? What? Tea party time. Slowly but surely. <laughs> All right, we are gathered here today. Tea time today. A new segment. Andre and Tyler having tea together like just two dudes having some tea in the afternoon, right? You ready to cheers it? Happy tea time, sir. Cheers. Or, Welly, if you're watching, brushed. Is it hot? Hold on. You didn't blow on it. We're going with the classic coconut nutmeg hot chocolate. Thank you, Lasco. Not sponsored, but call us. Ooh. 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 You 
you try it? Yeah. What do you think? Careful. Careful. Just a little bit. Hey, you can't give me a kiss. Because you got to blow on it, man. It's hot. Pencil. For what? A spoon? Because it's hot. So what's a spoon going to do? Huh. Maybe, okay. I love the reaction of like, you just put boiling hot water in a bunch of sugar and some little bit of chocolate and nutmeg and you're like, hold on, let me see my reaction. Yeah, yeah, you get a spoon for me. I don't need a spoon, dude. I'm slowly but- Andre, slowly but surely, man. Yeah, do the Dave approach. Hold on, how's that go? Mm -hmm. One spoonful at a time. Interesting tea party. Hmm. There you go. It's good? Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay, before we finish tea time, Andre's gonna explain the process of how to make tea. Here we go. Then put one then tea in there, then put one little, we put water in there, the mm. hot water. Uh-huh. And then what? Then we mix it. Uh-huh. Then. And then what? We come up. Then we start making the tea. And then what? We don't know. <laughs> How's the tea? Yeah. Now you know. Cool. Here's Mario. So who did you beat that? The Lasco lady. She got us all these teas. She was like, you guys need some tea. And I was like, what? We do. So and Mario was like, right? hold on, we gotta sneeze for a second. <laughs> oh, you took the picture? Oh. George, what I get you? Dave, chicken, flower, seven flower. Dry chicken. What? What? So So, me and Puri is here, and we're gonna go in the kitchen to cook them. Fries and fried chicken. So we wanna go in the kitchen right now. Let's go in the kitchen. Let's go in the kitchen. Let's go. Yeah? Mm -hmm. 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 Two of them are savvy. And then you have sauna here, so cut up chicken, right? Right. Chicken. Chicken. Yeah. Mm, not listen was that chicken. Yes, chicken. <laughs> mm. Bye bye. Bye bye. Emma. So Sorry. now we are seasoning up the chicken to fry it, and then. So after we season the chicken, we're going to let it sit a little bit. 
down. And then after that, we're going to put the pot on to hot with the oil. Probably one scotch bonnet pepper in it. And what else? One garlic. One garlic. <laughs> okay, then. I'm just helping them cook anyway. I'm not cooking for them. But you are doing <laughs> so Maria, I'll start the soa. The deep chicken is the one to the side. Yes. Mm hmm Good. Yep, that's their foolishness. Yeah, what are we waiting for, Andre? For dinner. Yeah, check out the cooks in the kitchen. Hold on. Yeah, they're working so hard. Yep. Man, look at them go. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. We'll just have to sit here and wait. I'm waiting. <laughs> We're waiting. Yeah. Uh, you bait it. Of course. I bet too. You bait too? Yeah. Oh my gosh, that's fantastic yeah. news. Yeah. That's great news. I'm happy for you. <laughs> yeah, just just waiting. They're working so hard. Yep. Here today oh, to enjoy some fried chicken and chips. Anybody want to say a few words? Thank you. Oh wow! Thank you. What a thank you, Andre. And Junior thank also you, says thanks. Who are you thanking? Donut. God <laughs> cooked the food. Count the Lord for providing this what? meal so we can all eat together. Yay! Yay. <laughs> We're eating. Go for it. What happens to what to say? Close enough. Yeah, he wants Kids. 